Hello and welcome to the tip of the week. I'm Dr. Amy Starr with the Mesa Veterinary Clinic, Paws and Hooves Mobile Veterinary Services, and San Francisco Stables. With the season uh, coming around that we tend to have thunderstorms, I wanted to talk to everybody about what you can do to help keep your pet as comfortable as possible. Uh, every year, obviously, we have a little season of monsoons and thunderstorms and lightning, and it can be very scary for both small and large animals. We tend to see more injuries during this time, uh, both in small and large animals. The horses obviously are outside, and they can get spooked by the thunder and lightning and the rain, um, and they can start running around their corral or their pasture and run into things and get cuts. So the best thing for the large animals is to try and keep them in a safe area. Um, you know, try to be vigilant, be out there uh, to check on them, make sure that they're comfortable, make sure that you don't have any loose wires, don't have any barbed wire, uh, and no open posts around that they might cut themselves on. Just maintain a good, uh, safe location for them to be, which should always happen anyways. As far as your small animals, the best thing to do is to be with them again. Uh, you can keep them in a smaller, quieter area in the center of the house. Maybe an area that doesn't have any windows. Maybe you have a bathroom or some place like that that they can be comfortable in. That they're not going to see the lightning and they're not going to hear the thunder quite as much. Uh, you can turn on music or be with them and, and maintain a calmness yourself. Don't get stressed out yourself because they're going to feed off of your anxiety and stress. Um, but you can main, you know, maintain your calm and comfort them, talk in a quiet, soothing voice. You can hug them. Uh, there are things on the internet that you can buy that's called Thunder Jacket. And for some pets that helps a lot, others it doesn't. Um, and you know, things like that to kind of help to keep them calm. Also, if the pets are extremely anxious, you can give them a tiny bit of Benadryl to help try and calm them down a little bit. It's basically one milligram per pound. And you can let us know if you have any questions about that. Uh, if they are worse than that, then you can come in and we can evaluate the situation and see if we need to give some type of a medication. But usually keeping them in a calm area uh, inside the house where they can't see the lightning is the best and then try and, and settle them with the noise of the thunder. If you have any questions or concerns about the situation, please feel free to bring them in and we're more than happy to talk to you about it. And I uh, hope you have a great week and enjoy the little bit of rain that we might get. Thank you, bye-bye.